What is up, everybody? And today I'll be talking about what's gonna be in Marvel for two, or Black Ops Two. Like, I, the only reason I think this is real is because like it was on a Call of Duty form and it got taken off right away, and that happened to someone. I forgot his name, but it happened to him too, and it ended up being the a real stuff from Modern Warfare 3 and then once Modern Warfare 3 came out it was like that si same exact stuff he said it was on Modern Warfare 3 so here we go with Black Ops 2 uh, game modes there's gonna be a new one called Escort uh, it's similar to Search and Destroy however a live player must be escorted to one of the three areas or two depending on the map without being killed so it's really close to search uh, the match will have rounds, considering of one life only, search, drop zone, and kill confirmed will return. Team, defender, and infected will not return. Yes, I hate infected and team defender. Uh, point streets were allowed, f point streets will follow from Marvel 3 system. Larger emphasis on objectives. A bomb plant is worth two points. A neutral flag is worth one one point. However, an enemy flag is worth two. A flag assist capture is worth one. A captured is a capture is worth two. So if you have a flag, is two. If you don't, if you just return, it's one. Um, the specialist point streak has been modified. Two kills now get you one perk. Uh, the fourth kill gets you two perks. Six kill gets you three more perks. Eight, the eighth kill gets you four more perks. You don't get every per perk once you reach eight anymore. You don't get that like in Marvel Three. Perks only become pro when you have them. Uh, pro. So you only get pro perks if you get them pro. RCXD will not return. Oh, narts! That made me mad. Heat vision, new thing. Heat Vision. It, it, heat Vision is a new point streak reward. When you get the required points, you can activate this point streak and you will, you and your players will pull out a scope and attach it to your weapon. That's pretty legit. The main advantage is its ability to dedicate, detect, my bad, detect enemies through. Uh, through most walls. Note, the scope can only be attached to primaries not including shotguns. Item packages require 5 points. Follow along side care packages and airdrop traps. Uh, future, a list of package package item only. Fe oh, features, my bad. I can't read today. Uh, so I'll read it. Follow along side care package. So required five points. Follow along side care packages and drop traps. Uh, features a list of packages, item only, including ammo, minigun, grenade launcher, rocket launcher, and body armor. So be this. Prestiges. There will be 15 prestiges. There will be 50 ranks. But for every two prestiges, there is a five rank increase the final prestige has 90 levels that's retarded i think um uh call Duty elite 2.0 so in uh black ops 2 there is gonna be call of Duty elite once again i think that's gonna be pretty cool because i like call of Duty elite doing this clan operation and crap i just thought that was like really cool so I, i'm glad this is gonna be back um, uh, Call of Duty Elite is being, uh, fully incorporated in Black Ops 2. Combat record has been modified and renamed as Elite Stats. So, I'm, I'm guessing that you're pretty much gonna have to have Elite on Black Ops 2. I'm just, I think that's what's gonna happen, according to the... There will be a specific lobby for clan matches, a new way of leaving clan, a new way of leaving clans. I guess that's okay, but I'm not leaving my clan. Chronic Gaming, I'll put their link in the description. Make sure you go subscribe to them. Uh, clan tournaments can now be 
impelimented. Removed. This is other stuff that will be removed. No MOAB or nuke. That made me so mad. Like, I was about to cry. Because those are so fun to get. But right when I heard this, no last stand, no dust streaks, no flamethrower attachment. That made me happy, dog. All better. Map design. Map design and size will be the following. Black Ops, not Model for 3. So none of the maps, the maps are going to be designed like Black Ops, not Model for 3. Which made me kind of mad because Model for 3 maps are made better and the quality is a lot better. Sniper rifles. Improve sniper rifles uses. No aim assist for any sniper rifles. So that is amazing because they should have took that out. Took that out a long long time ago I don't know why they didn't take it out on any of the other qualities but it just didn't customization no longer just perk one chooses the players appearance appearance is a com combined combi oh my god combination of all perks and type of point streak used that's gonna be amazing <laughs> hardcore a uh, longer emphasis on hardcore than ever before. No grenade launchers in hardcore. Yes! Only vehicles guided rockets permitted. So only vehicles will have rockets. So I'm guessing there's going to be vehicles in this game. You buddy. Kind of like Battlefield. Respawn time timing decreased for most modes. You buddy. One bullet in the foot will no longer kill a person. A head or chest shot is usually required. Now that is more like real life. That is more like real life. That is what's up. A person will now uh, blend or my bad bleed out of injuries. That's gonna be awesome. They're gonna actually like, bleed out now. That's what's up. So like bleed or blood will be like dripping all over the flow. I gotta hurry this up. All right, point streak 2.0. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. All right. Uh, the um point streak. Oh my god, that's a neck. I s I meant perk system 2.0. There we go. The uh, perk. Uh, the perk pro system has been upgraded. There is now two options a perk can advance to. Both require different challenges to unlock. Once the desired perk vision is unlocked, the player can select that as their pro perk. Once selected, there is no way to choose the other option it is by entering prestige mode. So the only way you can get to the other pro perk, because there's two, is if you do prestige. That's kind of retarded. For example, perk... Perk slot 1 has a perk challenge called speed. Speed reduces the time taken to aim down sights. Perk pro 1 swaps uh, weapons faster. Pro 2 throws, equi and throws equipment faster. So that is kind of retarded. So that is it. Combat training will return. And I'll put the rest. I did not read. It's only like a little paragraph in the description. So I hope you all like. So I'll talk to you guys.